Have you ever wondered if you possess an extraordinary coin worth a fortune? Believe it or not, there are incredibly rare coins out there that have sold online for mind-blowing amounts. Now, imagine stumbling upon one of these treasures. You'd want to ensure that you receive the full value for your extraordinary find without falling victim to scams or being taken advantage of. That's why it's crucial to be knowledgeable and vigilant when it comes to dealing with these one-of-a-kind coins. So remember, if you ever uncover a valuable gem, stay informed, stay sharp, and protect what's rightfully yours. You might have one of these incredibly rare coins that sold online not too long ago for a staggering amount of money. Now, if you come across a coin like this, you want to make sure that you get the full amount of money and you do not get scammed or ripped off. In this video, I'll show you what to look for and what to do if you come across one. So this coin right here is a 1944 coin, and it's one of the most rare and valuable coins that has captured the interest of collectors and at Numis. So in 1943, the U.S. Mint produced penny coins using zinc-coated steel to conserve copper for the war efforts. However, there were some coins that accidentally got struck on this zinc-coated steel planche in 1944, just like this coin did that was graded by PCGs at a mint's day 66. What you need to know is that if you come across a 1944 penny, it should be struck on a bronze planche and it should not look like this. If it looks like this, then you either have an altered or fake coin, or there's a very slim chance that you've come across a coin that's going to change your life. This coin sold for $408,000 because it's an authentic 1944 coin that was accidentally struck on a zinc-coated steel plant. Shit. Now this example right here sold for $504,000 and it's because it is the reverse of the previous coin. By that, I mean this coin should have been struck on a zinc-coated steel plant, but it was accidentally struck on a bronze planche. This is a 1943 S coin graded by PCGs at a mint state 63 brown. Now really quickly, let me show you a diagram differentiating the color between a red, red, brown, and brown coin. Now this can matter sometimes with collectors wanting to collect certain types of coins. Typically red coins will be more valuable because of the eye appeal. They have collectors like coins that look closer to their mint state intended condition and eye appeal, but the 1943 coin struck on a bronze planter is a perfect example of not needing to have a coin that is red, but instead having a coin that is valuable. Like this 1943 coin, if you come across one, please keep it safe. Get the opinion of multiple people before selling it because you could have a coin worth a ton of money just like this one that's over $504,000. If you enjoyed this video, smash that subscribe button and I'll see you in the next one.